Yeah, the trailhead's a little closer than 100 feet in the description. It's kind of demure too. You can blow right by it if you're not observant. And here it is. We're on the far side of the Moose Hill Sanctuary of the Massachusetts Audubon Society, probably my favorite of the various old organizations. Ha ha! Found it. We're at the Bluff Trail. Already discovered the charming Massachusetts Audubon signage system which has few equivalents. I like them because they're named after a guy who did killer bird paintings. Uh, so let's see. The trail description claims a bunch of steepness. This should be interesting for an out of shape weasel. Wow, we're on ledge and there's a view. This panorama is principally focused to the west. And it has something to do with a fellow named Allen's chimney. I don't understand what the chimney's about. It's some Yankee equivalent to an English garden folly, I suppose. Maybe there was a lodge here or strange Yankee barbecue rituals. Some such thing. <laughs> Alan's chimney. There's some steepness, but it was short and sweet. Of course, there may be more in the wings. Check back later. Oh man, I sure am glad I'm going down this thing and not up it. It's really steep. Going the other way wasn't too bad. Uh, more gradual, almost like a modified stuff and leaf form or something. Woohoo! This is the bluffs for which the bluffs trails have been so aptly named. And here's a short sweep of the cliff edge just to give you a sense of what we got. Good Lord. It's pretty impressive for little Massachusetts. We don't have big stuff, but what we got is cute. It has its own grandeur. Wow. Look at her go. Woohoo. Yeah, this might be some kind of Stoss and Lee formation. I'll know more as I exit, which is this way. <laughs> 